Our following breaking news surrounding the federal grand jury investigating former President Donald Trump and 2020 election interference. The grand jury has returned an indictment. CNN confirms the grand jury foreperson presented the indictment to the judge within the past half hour. The indictment is sealed and did not include initials of any person on the outside. Former President Trump posted on Truth Social this afternoon that he expects to be indicted after 5 p.m. today. His post calls it a fake indictment. We are continuing to follow new information as it comes in by the minute. Stay with Wish TV and wishtv.com for new details as we get them. And the former president has used millions of dollars raised by donors for his campaign to pay off legal bills. New filings show his joint fundraising committee has brought in more than $53 million so far this year. But Trump's Save America Leadership PAC reported more than $21 million is going toward legal consulting for the former president and his associates. To help cover their bills, Trump allies have launched a legal defense fund as an alternative fundraising vehicle. Well, a new poll from The New York Times and Siena College shows a tight match between President uh, Biden and former President Donald Trump in the 2024 presidential race. The poll found registered voters are divided evenly with 43 percent backing Biden and 43 percent favoring Trump if the election was held today. The survey also shows both Biden and Trump are viewed more negatively than positively by voters nationwide, with 54 percent saying they are uh, have unfavorable views of Biden and a 55% unfavorable impression of Trump.